We all know the statistics. Marriage rates are down, divorce rates are high, and over time, people become more and more dissatisfied in their relationships. Why are relationships so hard for people? 69% of problems that couples struggle with are perpetual problems. We call each other the work in progress. It's pretty much what our marriage has yeah, been. It is the work in progress. I do the work and she makes the progress. Yeah. How much are people cheating on each other sexually? 10% of children don't belong to their father, on average. Are you allowed to get a massage with a happy ending? <laughs> would that be cheating? I'm pretty sure I'm not, uh, but I'm not. Oh, I think if you that. asked, I would say yes, you can do that. I think if you were in Thailand are and you, you said... Are you kidding me? I was just in Thailand. <laughs> I know, I know. I know. Oh, you yeah. didn't ask. You should have asked if you'd oh. asked. Almost 0% of engaged people think they are ever going to get divorced. Women's criteria for what they find attractive in men changes depending upon where they are in their menstrual cycle. Couples should go off the pill for at least a year before they make any long-term commitments because they might not be compatible. How did you get Jordan to commit to you? Uh, I told him he could do whatever he wanted with anybody else. That broke me. She ran. I chased her. She caught me. Who's the boss more often than not in a relationship? Women. The woman. Women. I have absolute say at the end, but I don't say anything. You have conned us, man. Have conned us into thinking we're on earth for you. You're on earth for us and the kids. And if you do a good job, will keep you alive when you're an old fart.